Hello, and welcome to Run Me in Two Minutes. I'm going to go into the VS Code Marketplace and install the Run Me extension. Now you'll notice there's a new pane here that shows you all the, the Markdown files that can become runnable notebooks. This is just Markdown. Open it as a notebook and click Play. Let's jump into readme.md and see a little bit more of a real use case. I'm going to start by installing dependencies, installing the components required to talk to GKE. We need to tell it which infrastructure we're going to be talking to. In this case, it's project name. Cluster zone, you can set same defaults. Here, this is a URL to GCE instead of being code or bash. And when we run this, instead of getting text, we get a fully rendered list of clusters. Now, I've gone ahead and applied this application to the cluster. You'll see that it's off creating these instances. I've also forwarded the ports so we can access it from the browser if we wanted. The next step is to go to troubleshooting. This is a list of health checks and or troubleshooting steps you can take to give yourself a clear picture of whether the application is working as expected or not. I'm going to click Run All, skip any confirmations, and now as I scroll, we'll see all of these different steps completing. I also want to show off that you can write cells in different programming languages other than Bash. This is Python code as auto-detected by VS Code. Simply click Play, and it should run as expected. A lot of this functionality is also available from the CLI. So if I run Run Me LS, Trouble, which is part of troubleshoot.md, see all the commands that are available, and then Run Me from and then the name. Another cool feature you should know is the ability to create artifacts from workflow runs. I'm going to turn this autosave to on. And then when I run a cell, you'll notice that an artifact as a markdown is created here. And what's even cooler is if you're authenticated with GitHub, you can actually generate a gist. And that's just the tip of the iceberg. Check out runme.dev for more. Thank you so much for watching.